everyone. I am Veena Gandhi, Assistant Professor from Department of BCA Science. Today in this video we are going to see tokens in C language. Topics covered in this video are C character set, C tokens, keywords and identifiers. The first topic C character set. Like any language like Marathi, English have their own character set to form words, sentence or grammar. In the same manner, C programming also have its own character set. In the C programming language, the character set refers to a set of all the valid characters that we can use in a source program for forming the variables, identifiers, expressions, numbers and statements etc. C character set is divided into four parts, letters or alphabets, second digits, third special characters and fourth white space characters. Letters or alphabets. C character set uses lowercase alphabets and uppercase alphabets to form a variable name, identifiers, etc. It uses 0 to 9 digits for forming the numbers. It uses special characters like operators, plus, minus, asterisk, division, brackets, round brackets, opening and closing brackets, square brackets, curly braces, back quotes, at the rate, exclamatory symbols, comma, semicolon, question mark, etc. Special character contains arithmetic operators like plus, minus, asterisk, division, percent sign, brackets, round, opening, closing, round brackets, square brackets, curly braces, and punctuation marks like comma, semicolon, question mark, exclamatory sign, and other symbols like hash, dollar sign, hash, at the rate, uh, back quotes, tilde, etc. Now next white space characters. Now in any language, uh, uh, blank spaces are there between two words. In the same manner, white space characters make the C program more readable. Now white space characters in C language are blank spaces, backspace, vertical tab, new line, form feed, horizontal tab and carriage return. C tokens. The smallest individual element or entity in a C program that are meaningful to the function of C compiler are known as C tokens. Actually, C tokens are the main building block for constructing the C program. C tokens are classified into six types. These types are keywords, identifiers, constant, special symbols, operators and strings. The first part we will see keywords. C language has 32 keywords. Keywords are also known as reserved words. Keywords have predefined or special meaning to C compiler and these keywords are used to construct the program instructions. There are some rules about the keywords. Keywords are written in lowercase lowercase. Keywords cannot be used as identifiers or variable names. Keywords have fixed meaning or special meaning and that meaning cannot be changed. These are about 32 keywords. Ito, break, case, care, const, continue, default, do, double, else, enum, extern, float, for, go to, if, int, long, register, return, short, sign, size of, static, struct, switch, type, dep, union, unsigned, void, the right and while. By using these keywords, we can easily write a program, C program. Next token identifiers. Identifiers are user defined words that represent the names of various entities such as variables, array, functions, user-defined, types, labels, etc. 
means identity files are the name given by programmer to different programming elements. Now let us see rules for naming the identity files. A valid identity file can have letters, it can be uppercase or lowercase or both, digits 0 to 9 and underscore. But the first letter of an identifier should be either a letter or an underscore and it, then it can be followed by any number of letter, digit or underscore. The first character, the first letter of an identifier must be a letter with alphabet. It can be uppercase, lowercase or underscore. It should not start with number or any special characters. Third, Third rule, keywords or reserve words cannot be used as identifier names. Fourth rule, any blank space, commas, special characters except underscore are not allowed within an identifier. Fifth rule, there is no rule on how long identifier can be. Some compiler does not support if an identifier is longer than given characters and CC supports 32 uh, length of identifier. Identifiers are case sensitive means uppercase uh, variable and uh, lowercase identifier are different. For example, capital sum and small sum are two different identifiers. Let us see some example of valid identifiers. First length, it contains, it start with letter and contains all the lowercase alphabets. Second underscore size, it start with underscore followed by letters. Next length underscore, it start with letter followed by letters and underscore. Num1, it start with letter followed by other letters and digit. Num underscore 2 it start with letter followed by letter underscore and digit these are the valid identifier names let's see some example of invalid identifiers first five size it's invalid because it begin with digit next backslash at the rate hello it's invalid because it start with special character only underscore is allowed next int INT is a reserve word or keyword. Keywords are not allowed as a identifier names. M space N. It contains a blank space. That's why it is an invalid identifier. M plus N. It contains special character plus sign. That's why it is an invalid identifier. Now in next video we will see remaining tokens. Thank you for watching this video.